Hi everyone, today we are going to make foaming patchouli shampoo. These are the ingredients required. The first one is sodium cocal glutamate, cocoa betaine, disal glucose. This is sorbitol, solagum, sodium gluconate, silk amino acids, panthenol. This contains hydrolyzed protein, olivum 300 and also polyquats. This has the lactic acid, preservative patchouli fragrance oil and the last one is the distilled water. The weights and percentage of ingredients is in description box. Let's see how to make it. First, we will dissolve solar gum in this orbital. Now, we'll add water slowly and dissolve the gum so that it don't form lumps. More water and stir it gently. Now I'll pour this into the water face. Now we will pour the surfactants in another beaker. This is cocoa betaine. Next is diesel glucoside. And the last surfactant is sodium cocal glutamate. We'll stir it gently. If we do fast, it will generate lot of bubbles. Now we will heat this on double boiler until everything looks uniform. So it is off from the double boiler. We'll break the large chunks of silk amino acids and panthenol so that it can be added in the water phase. Now I'll pour it into the water phase. Again stir gently until everything is dissolved. You can say it is completely clear without any lumps or powder. Since this is a 250 gram batch, I am putting this in a separate beaker. First the surfactant phase. Now the water phase. I'm using fork so that it doesn't generate lot of bubbles. Now I will add lactic acid which is uh, used to reduce pH. Now we'll add hydrolyzed protein, polyquat and olivum 300. I also added two drops of color which is not measurable since it is of very less quantity. Now goes the preservative GeoGuard ECT. And the last one is patchouli fragrance oil which really smells great. You can see it started thickening after adding lactic acid. I have tested the pH and adjusted to pH 5.5. Now we'll pour it in a bottle. To adjust the pH, you can either add lactic acid to decrease the pH or add TEA to increase the pH. It depends upon the value that uh, you get after making this product.
and this is how it looks it has lot of bubbles now but it will disappear in some time you can see the thumbnail it doesn't have the, those many uh, bubbles at all i'll show how it forms let me add some water it has dense rich leather which you can see it here 